Are we doing this? This is an exciting day. I'm ready for this. This is huge. I'm so ready. Hey, hey Internet. Internet. Uh, we're here at Dark Side Records, and we got something special to share with you today. The Mother Gooch. It is the Kiss Kissteria Ultimate Vinyl Road Case. You can see it here in front of us. Uh, for their 40th anniversary, Mercury Records and UME released this box set housed in a heavy duty Anvil road case containing 34 LPs, including 19 studio albums, five alive releases, four solo records, and six exclusives never before available on vinyl. All pressed on 180 gram audiophile vinyl, some for the first time as far back as 1980. All the albums were painstakingly recreated from the original artwork and the audio was remastered in high definition DSD, which is direct stream digital for you novices out there. And uh, the reason for that is they wanted the maximum fidelity possible for your money. <laughs> <laughs> there are a bunch of uh, exclusive bonus items there in this box as well, including 12 11 by 17 archival posters, including the band's first ever promo poster, a mm -hmm. uh, Kiss vinyl cleaning cloth, a Kiss turntable mat, Kiss dominoes, a uh, band lithos, and a certificate of authenticity numbered. It's exciting. We're getting to know what number this one is, too. Indeed. Indeed. So this shit weighs almost 50 pounds 50 pounds and they only made a thousand of them and there really are for the mega fans and we happen to have one of those mega fans here with us the owner of this box set our good friend of the store Hello. byron what's up byron how we doing good man glad to be here yes i am you ready yes all right Jesus. it's all you the violence let it begin when we'll uh we'll let you do the honors here when did you first get into Kiss, Byron? When I was 12 years old. Yeah? My father bought me Kiss Alive. Haven't, haven't looked back since. First Kiss Alive? Yep. Have not looked back since. Yeah. How many times have you seen Kiss? At least 35 to 40 times. Wow. You ever met any of the band? No, never no. met any of them, no. But I have a lot of memorabilia. And because of you guys, I'm deeply in debt, but what the hell? Yeah, I wish we it? had some dry ice for so this. Do I. I know, this is so exciting. Here we go. There she is. Whoa. There she is. Beautiful. Awesome. Yes. Let's roll her around here. Okay. All right. All right. Byron. This is yours, Byron. Thank you. We're going to do the unboxing real quick. Cool. Then you get to take it home and. Sounds good to me. Do what you're going to do. Bye, Internet. Where do we even start? Uh, well, let's start with some of what looks like this bonus content that's right here in the front. Uh, this tube here covered in KISS tape. I'm assuming this is our... Uh... Must be all the posters. Yeah. Byron, I promise to be careful. Oh, absolutely. We should put our white gloves on. <laughs> yes. So, I won't show you all of these posters here, but as you can see... Oh, here's the KISS Psycho Circus. very first promo poster ever. That's right. So there's 11 more posters that are in here that you can check out. Let's see what's up next. We'll go with this uh, this special little envelope right here. It's got the uh, embossed kiss seal of authenticity there. They were fortunate enough to not stick it for you, so yeah. you can actually get into this without ruining it. Absolutely. You, sir, are the proud owner of box number 372. That's a low number. Yes, it is. 372, not yours. Tell us what number you got. How about that? And uh, I guess these are probably etched copies of their signature, or you think they're actually signature signed? I'm not sure. They might be printed. We'll leave a comment about that later. Mm -hmm. <laughs> also included in that envelope, here we go, getting into their photo Ooh. glossies that are included. These are nice. Yep, original lineup yep. in the makeup. Unmasked with Eric Singer. Unmasked with Eric Carr. And modern lineup. Looks like it even comes with a sweet Kisteria sticker. 
on black and foil right on the bumper and your certificate from Anvil with a lifetime warranty on the case itself. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Let's pull this out. Leave that right there. Okay. This is the cleaning cloth. I'm not gonna take it out. Kisteria cleaning cloth. Also here is the moisture absorbing pack that goes inside the case. Probably not important to note, but it's in there. I'm sure some Kiss collector is stoked to have I, this in I there. I bet you could buy that on eBay. Kisteria silica gel. Seriously. Uh, let's see, what do we have in here? I'll do my best to take everything out very carefully here. Oh, look at that, cool. Tin case here with the Kiss logo engraved in the top. And inside of it, your Kiss Dominoes. Ooh. Come in this beautiful case. In case you want to throw down on the, huh? the ivories. Even instructions on how to play Dominoes, oh. just in case you don't know. All right, I think that's it for that, Gooch. Let's, uh, let's get into some music here. Oh, nope, I'm not, we weren't done. We've got uh, an advertisement <laughs> for more Kiss stuff you can buy. <laughs> let's see if we can get it out. In case you were looking to spend some more money, Byron, you can get yourself the KISS pinball machine. And uh, they've included a handy flyer for you. So, things to consider. And then, we get to our, I'm not gonna take it out, KISS stereo turntable slip mat. So, obviously, whenever you're playing LPs from the KISS stereo collection, you will be using your KISS stereo slip mat. You want a handful? Sure. All right, let's do this. So once again, these are the 34 LPs, as I mentioned earlier in the video, that come in. They're all 180 gram, all with uh, recreated album covers, painstakingly recreated album covers, all featuring original artwork, some with special packaging, some with expanded packaging. We'll try to note what each of them has as we go through them here. Let's just make piles and we'll, we'll talk about it. But as you can see, there's a lot. So many. You like, you don't think, like 34 sounds like a lot, and then you actually see it. Mm hmm And here it is, so, shall now, we? I'm gonna assume these may have been in order initially. It doesn't seem like they were. No. Nope. We're just going to go through them as they are right here. All right, so, first time ever on vinyl. Kiss Psycho Circus with the lenticular cover. Mm -hmm. uh, pressed on 180 gram vinyl, of course. That does actually raise a great point. As you can see, each of them does come with a hype sticker. They're all individually shrink wrapped, every album in here. And they each come with a hype sticker that denotes the special features of each one in case you didn't know. Yeah. Or in case you don't intend to actually open them. So this one is Music from the Elder. This is the first vinyl press with the concept album sequence. Once again, also on 180 gram vinyl. Next up for me is Asylum, 180 gram vinyl, first pressing since 1985. Available right here in the box. Mm -hmm. This one here, of course the iconic Alive 2. This one features a tattoo sheet and an eight page color booklet and is in a gatefold cover. Uh, I'm going with Kiss Animalize up next. I'm gonna stop saying that for this one, but again, 180 gram vinyl <laughs> and the first pressing since 1985 edition. That's right. This one here is of course Kiss Killers. Now this is an exclusive title that is only available in this box set. This is the first ever US vinyl release ever for this album. Uh, and it combines both the Japanese and Australian track lists in one package. So this is a great piece for any Kiss collector, only available in the box. Mm -hmm. uh, next up for me is Hot in the Shade. First since 85, again. I got the 80s collection so far. <laughs> well. Uh, here for me uh, gets into the KISS solo records. This is of course 
Gene Simmons. Now, uh, all four of the solo albums have four interlocking album posters that uh, go in between them. I guess I've got all four here, so I'll just show them really quick so you can see them. There's Peter Chris, Paulie D, Ace, and the Space Ace. So all four solo records in one shot. Here you go. Next up for me is a live three, AKA the Millennium Collection. So this is the first time this has been repressed since 93, and it is only available in the box. We should note that this box was released probably two years ago now, and some of these records have been reissued, mm -hmm. but definitely not all of them, and none of them with the Kisteria hype stickers on them. Kisteria? That's where you get your Kiss lunch. Yeah, when yes, you're it's at Kiss HQ. After you're, you're done with your Kisteria, mm -hmm. you go down to the Kisteria, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and you get a tongue salad. <laughs> Uh, I don't like that. And I'm using the word gooch. Uh, this is, of course, Crazy Nights. This is the first vinyl reissue of the album since 1987. Next up, a fan favorite, Love Gun. Uh, this is the paper gun with the bang sheet. I don't know what that means, but it's full of bang. So that's all you need to know. Uh, this is, uh, of course, their iconic Destroyer. This is the first time this has been, oh, let me make sure I get this correct. This is the first U.S. pressing since the 1985 edition. A Kiss classic. Next up, my first exclusive to the box. Oh! I got one, finally. It's Kiss Alive 4, the symphony album. So... Only available, first time on vinyl, and only available in this collection. So, fight them. You're not getting it. <laughs> uh, next for me is Kiss Dynasty. Uh, this uh, one comes with an exclusive 22 by 33 poster. A huge Kiss poster included in this one. And it's a first U.S. press since 1985. Next up for me, though, my first one without a hype sticker. I find that surprising. Mm. Uh, it's Kiss Double Platinum. Of course, a fan favorite, favorite, mm -hmm. fan favorite, and one that whenever we get this in used, A, it's usually rough, and when we do buy it, it's gone. I think it's gone right away, so. That's right. Next up for me is Kiss Hotter Than Hell. Uh, this is uh, another one that has not had a U.S. press since 1985. Exclusive to the box. Kiss Greatest. So, a Greatest Hits, because you need that in a box that contains all the other songs. But in case you're just feeling a little lazy, don't want to go through the full 18 hours of music, you can just double down on Kiss Greatest Hits. That's right. Uh, the one that started it all, Kiss Alive. This one is another gatefold. This is a two LP uh, press of this, and it comes with an eight page color booklet. Another Kisteria box exclusive, smashes, thrashes, and hits. Can't get it anywhere else, only in the box. And the original, Kiss, self-titled. Uh, this is where it all started. Another, I'm, I've hit the mother load now. <laughs> I've got all the exclusives apparently. <laughs> so you wanted the best, you got the best right here. Only in the box set, not available anywhere else. I also hear uh, Kiss Unmasked. This is in their makeup free period. Uh, this is another one that comes with a giant 22 by 33 poster and another one that's a first US press since 1985. Next up for me, Creatures of the Night. First press since 85. I haven't said it in a while, so I'll say it again. 180 gram people, DSD mastered. I'm clearly in makeup free period kiss mm -hmm. here. This is the classic, lick it up. In the box, first time US press, I'm gonna stop saying that, since 1985, it's a bunch of them. Piggybacking on that one, rock, 
and Roll Over. Another fan favorite. A classic. Always goes used. Mm -hmm. Can't miss it. And that one, in fact, comes with a sticker sheet. Ooh. Here we go. Kiss Dressed to Kill. Back into the makeup. And this one has an embossed front and back jacket cover that you can see here. Kiss logos embossed into the front around the photo here. And same on the back. Uh, I clearly misspoke earlier because I said something else was Alive the Millennium Collection. But this one actually says Alive the Millennium Collection. So ignore me or tear me apart because it's YouTube and that's what you're going to do anyway, people. <laughs> so Kiss Alive the Millennium Collection. I could take the heat. Byron bought the heat. That's right. This one here, we're getting into later period unmasked Kiss. This is Kiss Revenge. That's it. For me, I've got Carnival of Souls, the final sessions. That's pretty special. I, uh, we never see this one, so beautiful. Mm -hmm. uh, here, if we get into very recent Kiss, this is Kiss Monster. As you can see, this is the current iteration of Kiss, uh, their modern lineup. This might be their latest record. Someone can verify that for me on the internet. All right. And last, and I feel like this is a good one to end on. A, a real fan favorite that even spans the casual user. It's KISS MTV Unplugged 2LP set. Also includes a 24 by 24 inches, that is, poster. So, goddamn. So much KISS in here. Do I need a cigarette? That's like, I don't even smoke, but that's, woo. So that's right, as you can see here, this is this is half of them. Half of the 38 LPs? 34 LPs that are included in this box set. These are going home with our good friend Byron. Byron, thank you. And uh, we would love to know your thoughts on the KISS box set. Tell us your opinions, tell us what you think about the packaging, about this amazing case. In fact, you should uh, show the bottom. Look at that. Real, real hardware casters. Like, this shit is metal. You could actually take this on the road. Nice little heavy bottom plate. It is a foam, like hard, dense foam lined interior. So, I'm gonna take all that impact for you. Mm -hmm. Of course, it's gorgeous finish. And the top over here has the screen to kiss logo on it. Um, we should say that maybe you don't, maybe you wanna do more than comment. Maybe you want one of these. You know where to find us. DarksideRecords.com. Let's talk. <laughs> Kiss fans, uh, we got you. We got you covered. Don't you worry. Uh, I guess that's about it for this video here. Thank you for watching. As always, please leave your comments below. Let us know what you think of this Kiss box set. Let us, uh, if you have one of these, tell us what you think. Tell us about the remastered audio. Tell us how you think it sounds. Uh, let us know what you think about the redone special edition packaging. Tell us what number you got. Tell us what number you got. Uh, and as always, please subscribe. Uh, we'll be posting a bunch more videos and great stuff on our channel here on both YouTube and Facebook. And as always, you can find great special editions like this, as well as new music, new stuff, all kinds of music, movies, and more here at Darkside Records, located at 611 Duchess Turnpike in Poughkeepsie. That's it for this one. Once again, thank you. And we'll see you in the bins.